Where are we going, Mason? To Target and Walmart. We're not going to Target. We're going to Walmart and Yarn Maven. I have to pick up a needle and a yarn for Erica. So. Can I get the, the yarn? You can have the bag. Place the order online. So you place an order online at Yarn Maven and just go and pick it up. Makes it so simple. And then you don't spend as much money. So, we're gonna go. Ready? It's 8 o'clock on December 7th, and this is how we're going to close out this video. We're going to talk about our advents and some knitting and some plans, some ch a change of plans, I guess, right? Mason's mm -hmm. behind us. <laughs> He's got the switch. He's playing Kirby. <laughs> and obviously, Isaac, Isaac is right there. With no pants. <laughs> All right, so you want me to go first? Yeah. There's an extra in here. I think it's candy. <laughs> <laughs> Day seven advent. Ooh. Ooh. Seventh day of Christmas, knitted wit. That's pretty. Mm-hmm. And that's a 10 gram and then a 10 gram KFI collection. That's pretty too. The lighting's not great. It's in my family room. And the, and the night, you know. Yeah. <laughs> this color is vanilla. Vanilla. <laughs> you want to hold this one? No. You didn't eat your mom's yesterday. He's like, don't take it from me. <laughs> I'll just wave it around. It's and there is extra. And it is candy. <laughs> so, is it upside down? I don't know. Yeah, there it is. Yum. All right, here, you want me to hold him? Just sit next to him. Just sit next to him. All right. Ooh. I got chocolate. Right? You got chocolate in yours? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Mason's got a great, I didn't even show it. Yeah, it is. It's by the Scrap Happy Yarns. Alright, y'all, back up. It is sunflower. <laughs> Anyways, Garden Maven. This is my little tiny bag. It has my name on it. Right? We just ran in. That's yours. Yep, this is my yarn. Um, this is mine. So, if you watch our regular podcast okay. episodes, this is uh, Malabrigo Rios and Aquamarine. And you'll know that I just finished a pair of fingerless mitts in this colorway. And my sister-in-law got them as part of her. He wants you. The only one spoon. <laughs> as part of her Christmas gift. And she asked for a hat. And I said, sure, but I needed more yarn. <laughs> 
So that's why I got this. All right. Why'd you get your needles? Can I hold them sweated? <laughs> They're US 9, 32 inch. I only. Okay, well. <laughs> this little portion has uh, got Brain all sorts chaos. of problems. <laughs> okay, chaos, anyways, because it's almost bedtime. No one likes bedtime. So. <laughs> Um, yeah, Daphne just discovered that her needles are not US 9s. They are the 32 inches, so yeah, that's fine. They're US 1s. Yeah, they're US 1s. <laughs> don't use 1s at all. Alright, well. We use a US 1 once. Mm -hmm. And then, never good. Yeah. But, so, she got them for a holding sweater, but she had already come up with another plan, which is good that you're got a needle problem. So, what was your plan? Alright. So, my baby is sleepy. In All right, Isaac went to Ralph. <laughs> but the Holden sweater, I have it. Couldn't really show it with Isaac. But anyways, so if you look, this is where you pick up, right? So this is the lower part, and then it sits on your shoulder like that and curls around. So this is basically just the top of your shoulder. Hot. So this is all the front, but that looks like it will fit me, which means it won't fit him. So I'm going to try to get the front done to pat like the chart that I'm working on, finish this chart, and then call it good enough for right now because I really like this, but it's not a practical knit right now for me anyways because I can only well I knit it in front of him. He hasn't questioned me at all. Probably wouldn't either way, but I wanted to fit him. You know what I mean? And this will not. So I'm going to knit the front and then give that, like, tell him about it on Christmas. But still going to make him stuff, right? Because I told him I was making him his gifts. And there was two of them already, so there has to be two of them. And then, so that was that pattern, right? And that's what the needle was bought for originally, but don't need the needle right now anyways but I could always use a more, another nine his second gift is his hat this is just hey y'all have seen it this is how far I am it's bigger from the last time but then I had to rip it out this morning because it started to curl like it was going straight down and I needed to go out further <coughs> so we're getting there and it's actually it's not that bad it's just, I've only worked on it three days. So that's only three days worth of work. And it's not very long it's at all. It's the time anyway. After we're done. Oh. <laughs> what time do I have? When we're done. Not long. No, not long. So that's that. But then, I feel like I'm missing something. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. One second. Here. It's just right here. Anyways, so you have seen all of this before. So, he was actually asking me the other day about socks and hats and all this nonsense, right? And all this nonsense, like, that's not what I wanted it. But anyways, so I decided I'm going to just do that instead. I have a lot of stuff right here. But anyways, so this one should be done. No problem, right? He's already expecting this one because I've shown him it, but... Doesn't know I've worked on it at all. So this is a Rafa's hat. The largest size. By Hoey Locatelli. Yeah, Hoey. US 5? US 6, that's one millimeter. So it's almost done, actually. It's got like one more full repeat and then the increase yeah, section. It's a free pattern. Shh. Tell me about your game after. Okay? So that should be done, no problem. Because it's like, at this point, it's like two days max. But then, I have more bags, right? So, I grabbed out this one. We've talked about this yarn the other day. This is going to be another Rafa's hat. And this is Willow Cottage Yarns in the Scouts colorway, which is, we're re-watching. We just caught up almost to where we are at in Attack on Titan. It's an anime, <coughs> as everyone knows. But he's like, you still have that? And I'm like, yeah. He's like, what's it been, like two years? And I'm like, mm, maybe three. So we're going to knit that and not let him know. What are you going to knit that into? A Rafa's hat. Oh, okay. 
But he has said that's his favorite hat pattern, so we're just going to do those because I can knit them in like three days. Start to finish. Three and days. He wears done. a hat like every day, so. He wears a hat every day. If we leave the house, he wears a hat, whether it be a beanie in the colder months and then a baseball cap all the rest of the months. You know what I mean? Just depending on what the weather is like. But then if I have enough time, <coughs> I have this one, which is, <coughs> what is this brand? You and I. In the Bakugo colorway. And that's another anime. Be... It will be another Rafa's hat if I get that far. If not, it's okay because I have two more. These are not Rafa's hat. These are just socks. This is a wide rip sock and this is a yarnable color called Love Language. And his second favorite color is purple. So I feel like anytime I get a yarn that's got like love in the name. It sucks for him. <laughs> That's the second one. I don't get love yarn very often. But, and then of course, how cute would it be if I surprised him on Christmas with matching Christmas socks? Because I already have gingerbread socks by West Yorkshire Spinners. So, I need some too, right? And I feel like this is much more doable. I mean, I know some people are probably looking at me like I'm crazy because I'm like, I'm going to drop a sweater and knit. Six Three hats yeah. and two socks Five by Christmas. Yeah. But in my opinion, that's more doable. Yeah. <laughs> so. All right. And, and sew together, weave together, whatever you want to call it, another hat. <laughs> yeah. Right. Well, I'm still working on the same one project <laughs> that I've shown. Um, and I wanted to say, because I don't know if this is clear, that every time I've shown it in like a non-talking clip after I've shown it I move the marker so that that shows the progress from clip to clip and I haven't shown it at all today so this is where I moved the marker up to yesterday that was cute and that's the um, progress that I've made I made this morning like for like early this morning like 6 a.m. or something that's a decent amount yeah so I've got I've gotten into the stockinette stitch so this is uh, two by two ribbing on a US 5 and then stockinette stitch on a US 6. And I'm just using um, the numbers from my Arise hat pattern, but I'm obviously making um, modifications to it. And I do plan to um, put those in my notes on Ravelry and I'll probably do a little blog post about it too. So once it's done, but I hope to finish that Soon enough, now that I'm in the stockinette. All right. I have only sewn together and then ripped back the straw hat. Today? Yes. Yeah, that's the only thing you And have. then I made cinnamon rolls and then ran mm -hmm. the rain. I'll pop in a picture yeah. of the cinnamon I'm rolls at the end. All right, well, that's it for today. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>